This is something that my wife is trying to sell, a Black & Decker toy set. This is rule number three I have when you're trying to sell something in person, online, through let's say Facebook or OfferUp or Craigslist. Um, sometimes you get people who say like, hey, I, I can't go there, can you just drive? And uh, I'll definitely buy, just you know, drive to where I'm at. So it might be like 15 miles or 20 miles away. I, I definitely suggest never to do that. Just because at that point, you've already wasted gas, you waste your time, at which point the person will try to most likely uh, haggle. They'll say like, oh, I don't want to pay $5 for this. Can I just buy it for a dollar? And then at which point you've already wasted your gas to drive over there. And they've pretty much duped you. So this ha this did happen recently to my wife. She wanted to sell a bed for, it was only like $25. So the person said, okay, some, you know, a little bed like that or something, or cushion. They said, oh, we really want it. Can you just drive out to where we're at? We'll pay you the gas. So my wife said, okay, pay me extra $10. And when she said that, I told her, don't do it. It's not worth your time. Anyway, she did do it. She drove down, you know, it was like 50 miles away. She drove down there and the person uh, met up with her and didn't know anything. I guess, you know, a friend had found it or a sister had found it and then told her sister, oh, you should buy it. My wife gave him the stuff. And then she took the money. Now she's walking away. The money was only half of what she'd asked for. So she, she needed $35 and they'd only paid her $20. Now, you know, it's missing money. So at that point, my wife asked, you know, where's, you know, where's the rest of the money? In which case the lady st started giving an excuse like, oh, I'll, I Venmoed it to you, didn't I? And my wife's like, no, you didn't Venmo me. And then she's like, oh, let me see if I have the cash. So, you know, you shouldn't need to go through that kind of, you know, uh, just you shouldn't have to deal with that. You're in a really worse position when you have to drive to someone's location. So, you know, if you're trying to sell something, just do it according to what's easiest for you. So... You put something online and they go like, oh, I want to buy it for this much. And they'll probably give an excuse like it's too much gas to drive down there. And just say like, that's fine. Just if you're in the neighborhood, uh, you know, buying uh, shopping stuff, you can come by and try to buy it if you're available. Just always make it convenient for yourself. So if you're going to sell it, sell it close by and at the time that's most convenient for you. So that's my advice for when you're selling stuff on Facebook Marketplace or OfferUp or Craigslist. Do it close by. Never do it where they're at. Otherwise, you're in bad shape in terms of negotiation. Even if you, you know, even if you agree at a price and whatever, they're, get, they're just going to try to, oftentimes they try to waste your time and try to haggle and whatnot. So that's my story.